can't forget the clapboard. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to The Retired Gamer. Got an exciting reaction video for you. It's from Everglow with First. So let's get right into it and make it happen. All right, so opening shot details. This looks like it's going to be really awesome. This mask reminds me of the character um, Sector in uh, Mortal Kombat. Cool shot. Really, really um, extreme close-up of the... Okay. Wow, great hair. Wow, this looks sick. Man, this set right here... Um, looks like they might have been in a really, really high-end studio in this... Um, group might be really, really, really big because it looks, looks like a very, very big budget um, shot here. Okay, great choreography here. Yo, fire. Yo, this is dope. Yeah, that's fire. All right, let me bring that back real fast because I, I really love this and appreciate this. All right, so let's see. How, how can we actually... So a big dipper up there. So I lo love the particle effect right there. Um, like a um, software like Trap Code Particular can, can create that right there. This right here turning into this huge mist and stuff is absolutely remarkable. Done extremely well. And the just the shadows and stuff is done it, make, it gives it a realistic impression. Love that 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 kind of wave right there. Good transition. Yeah, these shots feel like they're handheld. A lot of movement in the, in, the, in the shot itself. Oh, that sub's nice. Yo, where choreography is concerned, all of that uh, making arrows, bringing that together with the electricity in between the hands, it just gives the dance move so much more effect. And it's just like those videos where you see somebody dancing and they're, they, they got all these different type of energies coming from them. Really, really cool. Transitions are fire. Really good. Love that parallax shot right there. Hope they come back to that. Yeah, they did. There you go. The editor here did a very good job, too. That shot right there almost looked like a video game, right? Let's, let's bring that back. This parallax shot right here moving to the right, right here. It's something about their movement and stuff, but... uh. Really dope. Wow. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That blue hair just has such great contrast there. I like this. You know what? I like the section of this song right here, like the like like their 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 rap segment right here. I'm gonna bring that back. I want to see that again. I kind of want to like listen a little bit. So that that sound underneath the bass right there. It kind of gives it a edge without without tr that that section right there where that bass drops. It kind of gives it an edge without going over into that that rock area. So I did peep how that was kind of uh, somewhat restrained right there in the music. So that, very very intentional.
This is so artistic. I love this. Fire. Yeah, you know what? I there, I'm already paying attention to the music and the cinematography. It's so difficult to actually watch this the first time and try to read also. So it's just like uh, I'd rather just listen to the the flow of the music, the delivery of the music, and look at the cinematography of the actual music video. That that's what what interests me most. And um, I'll circle back to the words. So these shots, when you see them moving and they're going from, from frame to frame, like seamlessly with their transitions, like right there, that was a transition. That, that's, this is two different shots. So that means that they either cropped in with the same shot or they had to um, go through rehearsals with this shot more than once, which I think that probably is the more realistic approach and answer. Yeah, they're taking these particles to the next level right here with this Doctor Strange type world that they're in right now. Very, very cool. That's another video. Just make sure you remind me. I like the space area. I hope my answers of like a bridge comes in at some point in time. Like, um, I do like the hook. I do think that there's an opportunity for a really, really dope drop that um, I was expecting that I haven't heard yet. So I'm hoping it happens. Okay. Wait, yo, why haven't they brought that in sooner? Bro, come on, Everglow. Y'all should have dropped that beat back here and then had the rap segment go in on that for like maybe six to eight bars and then go back into the first. Oh, man, that would have been dope. I mean, so um, really, really cool. But regardless, this, yo, Everglow first, extremely well done. The particle effects and the overall... It's like just the the transitions particularly stand out to me. Um, they they were really really clean. I love the camera movement that we've seen a lot. Um, musically, um, I did think that they were were, were kind of teeter tottering on that rock side of things, but not really trying to go head first into that. Um, musically, um, not necessarily what they're saying um, lyrically or, or delivery wise. Um, I think th that that one section I. I guess I'm more of the rap fan, so like I always, I'm looking forward to that now in the K-pop groups and the K-pop songs. I'm like looking for the rap section, like where is it at? Where is it at? And why do they only get one little section? We need to have that. We gotta have it spaced out like two to three times. And maybe it doesn't have to be much. Maybe a couple bars here and there, but just something and kind of like, kind of, kind of keep that flow in there to to satisfy the listener. That's like me. You know what I mean? So, um, but with that being said, I'm just going to give this another like in the, the bucket of 1.4 million. I had no idea this song even existed and it has 100 million views. So it just goes to show how much I have been sheltered as a YouTube child. Oh, please get me out of this cocoon, everybody. All right. So with that being said, can't forget about it. I'm signing off. Hope you enjoyed this segment of the Retired Gamer. I just reacted to Everglow with first peace.